member of the Information Society? That's a difficult question because I didn't know we were in the Information Society. What is up guys, Karma Medic here and welcome back to another dose, another day, another vlog. I've got a really interesting day today so I thought I'd bring you guys along with me. Ignore my red nose, I know I'm quite sunburnt, I just went on a snowboarding trip. It was an absolutely crazy time, I highly recommend you check out that video. Just had my morning coffee which means that I'm able to speak to you guys right now. I don't say a single word in the morning before I have my coffee. I'm just gonna go fix my hair, make some breakfast, pack my bags and we'll be on our way. See ya! All right, so I'm going to the library and I'm playing basketball today, which means two things. All right, so I'm about to start my day. It's about 8.30 in the morning and I'm heading to Guy's campus to the NHH New Hunts House Library where I'm gonna sit and have a pretty decent library sesh to get my day started. So I'm now on my way to the tube station and this is probably one of my least favorite things about London is getting on the tube early in the morning during rush hour or even in the afternoon but it's just so claustrophobic and cramped, dirty, sweaty, hot. I hate it. All right, and we've arrived on campus. I'm sitting outside of the Chandler Sale Building. And I'm about to head into the library, which is over there. Yesterday, you might have seen on my Instagram story that I finished my student selected component essay, which is a huge relief. So it was a 2000 word essay and I just banged it out in about half a day or so. So I'm really happy to have that done. Today, I'm just gonna work on focusing on lectures, taking notes for my upcoming exams. So I can just get a head start on that because I'm flying to Greece soon and I wanna be able to spend time with my girlfriend, my friends and family without being too, too worried about work. So yeah, about to head into the library and I'll see you there. personal tutor meeting now in the Henriette Raphael building. Alright, so that was a nice quick meeting with my personal tutor. Basically, you can go to talk to them about any problems that you're having either within school or outside of school. You also have to meet with them three times on a yearly basis, so I was just meeting with him now for the third and final time, getting my portfolio signed off, which I have to hand in at the end of this year. Anyways, I'm going to head back to the library now for another couple hours of good revision before I break for lunch, and hopefully I'll be seeing Kenji then playing a little bit of ping pong and relaxing a bit for the day. So see you guys in a bit. So this all behind me is called Boro Market. It's about a two, three minute walk from Guy's campus here at university. And it's basically a collection of like a bunch of different stalls selling all kinds of different ethnic food and desserts. And they even have some like pottery and things like that. Just a little bit of art sprinkled in there as well. So this is where I come sometimes to grab lunch when I'm done studying in the library or I want to break a little bit from campus. So I'm gonna walk around here and see what lunch I can find and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so that is lunch all done. I'm gonna head back to the library for a couple of hours now before going to my good friend Aaron's student selected component presentation. So you know how I wrote that essay on HIV uh, vaccine prospects and challenges? My friend, his project, it was based on taking photos and videos of medical students that have passion projects outside of medical school. And so I'm one of the students featured in his project and he's gonna be presenting it on campus today. So I'm gonna go check it out and support him and see what it's all about.
All right, so I think I'm done studying for today. I spent quite a few hours in the library, I'm heading over to my good friend Aaron's art exhibition. So I'm pretty excited to go see what he's done and I'll take you guys along with me. It's absolutely wonderful, I think. Well done, congratulations. I'm interested in portrait photography, so I've been spending the last few months shooting with other year two medics, and I've realized that there are a lot of things that we do outside of medicine that we really love, that we've brought in, and it really helps us get through this course. So that's when I realized, why don't I try to take photos of them in their moment, and also capture stories of them doing what they love. And I've put a stethoscope around each of them to put in what identity feels like when you're a doctor, but you're also everything that you came in with. Well done, Aaron. <laughs> Thank you. That's awesome. All right, off to basketball now. I don't know if I've talked about this much on the channel, but sports and exercises are a really big part of my life. I really, really enjoy exercising. And if I'm not going to the gym, I'm usually going for a run or playing basketball. I do each of those things at least once a week. So I try to get two to three days of exercise per week in my life. And I find that that really helps me cope with stress from university, stress in other parts of my life. And it just sort of gives me a release from like the rest of the day and the rest of the things that I'm doing. And it's one of the things I look forward to the most every single week. So I'll catch up with you guys when I'm done with the game. absolutely knackered and definitely looking forward to going home. Although I usually cook all of my meals when I'm at home, I don't have anything prepared and it's quite late at night and I have an early wake up tomorrow because I'm going to the GP to sit in and see some patients. So I've just ordered some chicken from Nando's and I'm really looking forward to eating that when I get home. It's been an absolutely exhausting long day. Did a lot of stunning, a lot of fun extracurricular activities and just things to like spice up my day a little bit. So I wasn't sitting in the library for the whole time. Hopefully you've enjoyed this vlog and you've got to see how it is that I studied during exam season. I try not to stay in the library for like 12 hours in a row. I do four hour blocks and in the middle I go for lunch or meet some friends, play some ping pong, whatever it is, just to sort of break up my day a little bit. I'm trying to find some light out here. I am back with my bags in the same place as they started earlier today. I'm just gonna make myself a quick protein shake, have the chicken that's coming from Nando's and it's on its way. I'm really excited for that. If you guys have enjoyed this vlog, do leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel plenty more vlogs and videos coming every single week so I will see you guys in the next video hope you're having a wonderful day peace